guys i'm back with another video and this time it is google analytics in this video i'm going to talk about the biggest problems that i see with google analytics since i am into training i see a lot of people not being able to use google analytics to its full potential so i'll be covering the most frequently asked questions these are areas where i see marketers struggle the most and that's why i'm actually starting a series on google analytics wherein i'll be making a video on each of these problems that i'm about to list so the first video that will be out will be about how to clean up your Google Analytics data. Now one of the biggest challenges that marketers face is that Google Analytics shows a lot of spam traffic. And because of this, since these are not real people that are coming to your site, you don't get to see the actual picture of how users interact with your website. I'm going to show you some simple hacks that will eliminate 100% referral spam and ghost visits. Now some of you might not be aware about what are ghost visits but for now I will just tell you this that these they are the number one source that is corrupting your data. Also I will show you a quick way of blocking yourself from Google Analytics even if you have a dynamic internet IP. The second video will be about URL Builder, also referred as memory tagging. Now URL Builder is this amazing tool to which you can precisely track performance of each visit that happens on your website. Especially when you generate traffic through custom campaigns like Facebook campaign, LinkedIn campaign, Bing campaign, email campaign or through affiliate links. You can track the performance of each of these campaigns very precisely using URL Builder. When you manually tag your links, you can pass some additional data into Google Analytics and that's why this tool is very handy. It can help you optimize your overall marketing campaigns. The third video will be about goals and events. Goals measure how well your website fulfills your target objectives. Some examples of goals include you will be able to track purchase on an e-commerce site, submitting a contact form for a lead generation site, PDF downloads, link clicks, video play button clicks or any other button that you want to track on your website. The fourth and the final video of the series will be about segments and remarketing. I will show you some really cool segments that will give you access to some really crucial data about your site. I will also tell you how to remarketing from Google Analytics. For those who are not aware about remarketing, let me tell you. So you might see some ad on the internet that follows you for weeks and weeks. Let's say you go on Amazon, you look at a product, but then you don't buy it. And then when you just browse the web, you see the ad of the same product that you were checking out on Amazon. This is called remarketing. I will tell you how you can do this from Google Analytics. So these are some topics that I'll be covering in this Google Analytics tutorial series. If you're struggling with anything in Google Analytics and you want me to make a video on it, let me know in the comment section. I will do my best and make a video on it. Also, these videos will be out in the next two weeks and if you think they will add some value for you, so make sure you hit the like button. Also, subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out. I will see you guys soon. This brings me to a hack number three. Now this hack will blow away your mind guys but before I reveal it, a small disclaimer. Please don't use it to spam people and act responsibly. So did you know you can download an excel file with the contact details of all your LinkedIn connections. Now this could give you access to some really accurate database.